Hey guys, this is Barry Guy 88 and welcome to Let's Play Earthbound. This is episode 80, and this game is brought to you by GameVideoWell.com. Yeah! Last episode, we were exploring Jurassic Park. I, I, I mean, uh, the Lost Underworld, my bad. Uh, and we're now in Fire Springs to get the last melody. Now, we just want you, this is a very, very confusing place. So, we're gonna, it, so I, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you the best place to... Okay, hold on a minute. That's the Psychic Psycho. It has a 4 128 shit dropping a PSI caramel. And he has uh, uh, PSI fire attacks, obviously. Now, uh, where can I get a suit like that, man? It's on fire. That has to be very comfortable. I mean, really. Wow, your skin is just burning the whole time. But that's okay. Because everyone should get a suit like that, man. That's cool. Alright, anyway. The purpose of this episode is what I meant to say. What we're going to do here is we're going to show you the best path to... Go in, in uh, Fire Springs. Yeah, I'll also get you the items that you want to get. Also, yeah, the uh, Psychic Psycho is also we could get ice, of, of obviously. That was the majority of these enemies are. So just follow what we're doing here, and you'll be able to get through Fire Springs with no problems, without getting lost anyway. The enemies are a completely different matter. Okay, there's the major Psychic Psycho. Now he has a one in 120 chance of dropping a star pendant and. Yeah, this is another item that I think you might want to actually try to get here because the star pendant is one of the best accessories ever in the game. It can protect you from almost everything. So if you want to grind and then try to find these guys, find the star pendant, you can do that. But I'm not going to do it because we're because I already established how perfect we are. Yeah, no, we 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 don't really need to do that. But just, that's just the if you feel like completing everything. So anyway, yeah, the major section circle is. Well, it's pretty much the same as the second cycle. He's very, he's stronger. But wow, now this is a purple suit. Okay, yeah, this enemy is definitely not a uh, recolored at all. Yeah, he has some differences. Like, uh, let me see here. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. The, his tie is the same. His face is the same. His look is overall the same, except he's a different color. Nah, nah, he's recolored. Okay, never mind. My bad. Oh, well, well, yeah. Paula and Jeff are completely protected by the fire attack because Paula is wearing the C pendant. And Jeff still has the flame pendant on. But yeah, that's awesome. Yeah! Use that freeze gamma there. That's right, Paula. Yeah! Uh-oh. Oh, oh yeah, more PSI fire attacks next. No big deal. But yeah, uh, Paula and Jeff are definitely going to be very comfortable here. I don't know about the rest of us, though. But yeah, we did it. We beat these guys, of course. Awesome. All right, let's keep going here. All right, now there's a item over here. Don't climb up that ladder. You, you don't need to go that way. There, there are other items here, but they're not very useful, except maybe the drag, the back of Dragonite, if you like that, but we already have too many of those. We're going to equip the chi rub pendant on, or uh, cheer up thing, bracelet I think that's what it is, okay another enemy here, whoa it's the soul consuming flame, it has a 2 of 128 chance of dropping a meteor right in, he has extremely powerful fire attacks but he's horribly horribly weak to ice, I mean it's really, it's really sad actually, yeah but other than that yeah he's like very very strong and if you're uh, people are not get the, have don't have the right pendants on. They can get hit up to like around 200 or 300 HP, and that's very very bad. So just keep that in mind. Okay, there we go. All right. Oh yeah. Okay, my bad. We do climb up this rope. Okay, I don't know what I was thinking there. All right. Yeah, let's beat this old Kazumi flame again. Yeah, I I, te I told you all that that I know where we're gonna go, but. Yeah, I made that mistake. Okay. But yeah, we are supposed to climb up that rope. And we're gonna take the first uh, cave to our right. Not the other two ca two doors that not the other two caves that are up there. They lead to items that doesn't matter. Yeah, this way, cave right here. Oh, and yeah, oh, figures more enemies. That's just wonderful. Uh oh. Oh no, it's the evil elemental. He has a uh, two at 128 chance of dropping a luxury jerky, and uh, yeah, of course he has fire attacks, and I think, and I believe since he's a ghost, he can also possess you, so we gotta avoid that too. 
So let's go ahead and go ahead and get rid of them all. Yeah! Man, I miss Poe using his, his PSI Star Storm, man. That was so destructively awesome! But don't worry, in a, in a few moments we'll get a chance to see that. Alright, yeah! Hey, Bazooka action! Oh, oh, and more PSI fire, okay. Also, another another good tip is that if you uh, if you care, you can just put a, a psychic shield like PSI shield, Sigma, or Omega, if you have that, and you'll be safe too. All right, yeah, there we go. So that takes care of him, of course. Now, yeah, that's all the enemies here. We're going to be start meeting some clones of these enemies in a few moments. So yeah, Jeff leveled up, I've just noticed that. Yeah! And, we're, and uh, since Ness and Poe's HP are lower than what I want it to be, we're gonna use... Just gonna use Life Up Omega to take care of that. Oh, come on! What the? That wasn't even fair! We just egged it through! The enemies here are just so cheap now, come on! Oh, this is gonna be painful. Oh, no! That's like the same, same thing as using PSI Fire Gamma. Oh, man, that, that was really painful. Oh boy. Okay, well, well, we're okay. Ness, Ness got hit a lot, but he'll be fine. All right then. Paul's gonna you will hand use the usual freeze gamma. Okay, and Paul will just regular attack because his attack is almost as strong as uh, him just using his PSI attack. So I don't know why Poe uses his PSI attack sometimes, and then I don't really can just attack. But don't ask me. This is Poe's doing. I mean, he is the honorable, the one that he keeps mentioning to himself annoyingly. Alright, there we go. Yes, yeah, okay, let's go. Let's keep moving forward here. Let's heal ourselves some more. Yeah! Okay. And just, okay, alright, that, alright, uh, we get to fight the evil element elemental alone. Okay, that's cool. Okay, come on, guys. How can you keep missing? Ugh. Okay, and its physical attacks are pathetic, so yeah. There we go. Alright, that takes care of him. Yeah! What the? Oh, man, they got cheap again. I didn't think he was going to get us. Oh, come on. Oh, man, don't use that flame attack again. Oh no, it's the flaming fireball. I guess it's just like PSI, uh, fire gamma on one person. And it sucks that a, uh, Saki shield can't protect us from this, so that, that's really bad. Well, well, who cares, right? Because we defeated him for sure. Yeah! Okay, let's go in here. Oh, uh, let's see if we can get a better. Th uh, oh, oh, come on now. See, they did it again. Ah, oh, come on. Ugh. Okay, yeah, now they got pulled this time, and he's really badly injured. All oh, right, good job, Jeff Ball. Yeah. Okay, that takes care of the that guy. Uh oh, okay, I guess one enemy's good enough. Okay, wow, this is not getting annoying, and this is really not uh, consuming Paul's PP right now. He, which he needs it to go against the boss. I wonder if the boss is gonna just be a fire creature, just like everyone else. That would that would make a lot of sense. Alright, yeah! Good job, Oh, You're awesome, especially with all your equipment on. Wow, and it'll be the last time I'm ever gonna get it. <laughs> okay. Yeah, the this doesn't lead to the boss, but it leads to a very cool item we're gonna get real quick. We, luckily, there's no enemies. Yeah. All right. This is the Moonbeam Gun. Let's see if it's gonna be better than uh, Jeff's baddest be uh, beam. All right. Let's find out. 
Whoa, wait, it definitely is. All right, good job there. You got a mood weapon from that's from the mood. Okay, all right, that's just stupid. Okay, now now we got all the items we care about. It's time to head over to the boss. But first, we gotta face annoying enemies that we beat a billion times. And I don't know if we got t enough time to beat them all, but let's see if we can. Alright, let's see here. Yeah, alright. Yeah! Okay, he's still standing, obviously. But still, yeah! Oh, I do more fire attacks again. Oh, I dig another uh, interesting thing is that you can. Okay, never mind. Forget the episode. Then. All right, that's the end of episode eight. See you for episode eighty-one. Forget what I said about that. This is very good. I'll see you guys later.